What's up guys, today I'm going to share how much you can make as a very, very, very small YouTube channel. So stay tuned to hear all about it. Hey guys, my name is Jesus Martinez and I'm a Sanio photographer trying to go full time. So make sure you hit that subscribe button to follow the journey. All right guys, my channel, it is not the biggest channel out there. I have barely got to 500 subscribers and it's taken me about a year and a half to get there. Now, I wanna start off by saying what revenues I've actually tried to bring from my YouTube channel. And first off is actually the Amazon affiliate link. Now, if you've been watching this channel, you've been seeing how I've been mentioning them lately because it is actually the third time I am trying to get approved by them. Because the other times I had much less subscriber counts. The first time I made zero sales, they totally denied me. The second time I made a couple sales within a couple days, but they totally canceled my account, which really surprised me because I thought they were gonna keep me for at least three months and then let me know what happened. But last time I actually looked at the reasons why they didn't accept me. And one of the reasons was you need a minimum of 500 subscribers. So keep that in mind, guys. I know there's a couple other regulations. I do not know them at the top of my head. If I find an article that I had seen a while ago, I'll definitely be linking it down there so you guys have a better idea of how it works. They will not accept you right off the bat. Trust me, I've denied twice already. Now, presets. Everybody talks about presets and I finally got through with this and I created them, I opened a big cartel site uh, like Jacob Owens talks about, um, but not a single sale has gone through. I haven't really pushed them as talking about them and really promoting them in my channel, so maybe that'll help out, but we'll see where that road takes us. I was thinking of going the Selfie way where people just pay what they want because I think that's kind of cool. Pretty much giving them out there and if someone is able to give money you know, to help out the channel, then that, that'd be awesome. And if you can't, then you still have access to them. So we'll see which route we take. But so far, presets, zero money. YouTube ads. Everyone talks about YouTube ads, but I'm sure by now everybody knows how long it takes you to get there. And I am barely halfway there. Now this is halfway there because I am at 500 subscribers and my watch time is finally starting to move. About a month ago, I was only like a, a third of the way there. And it, that took me about a year, year and a half to get a third of the way there on the watch time. But in the recent weeks that I've been uploading every single week, I've been noticing that my view count has been almost doubling every month. So still no YouTube ads revenue. So how much have I made? If you've stuck around this long, get ready for it. Drum roll, please. $100. Yes, I've only been paid a hundred bucks through this channel that I've been working on for over a year and a half. So that goes far to say, do not do this if you're in it for the money because it's a long road to get there. Now this $100 has all been through the Amazon affiliates. And like I mentioned, they denied me the last time, but I made sales. I actually made about $60 of sales. And this time around, I'm right around $40 of commission sales. So um, th that's about a hundred bucks, which I still haven't received because they still got to approve me or deny me. Now I will say I've only gained a hundred bucks in YouTube revenue per se, but I've gained a lot more in video editing skills and photography skills and more of an urge to go out and create. And that's what I really enjoy about having this YouTube channel. Now, obviously my views aren't there to show it, but out of what I've learned, I think it's more valuable and I've definitely been able to make way more money out of what I've learned from practicing and making and filming and editing, creating these videos for this channel. When I started, I was actually editing everything on iMovie until I finally decided I was gonna step up and learn Premiere Pro. So I bought the program and I had no clue what I was doing, just watched as many tutorials as I could and I learned the program. Now I gotta work on my color correcting because I know it still needs you know, a little bit of work. I mean, everything in general, just there's so much to learn about it. I'm starting to kind of get a hold of the audio, which it's still whole new industry. What I was trying to get at with this video is I've been doing this for about a year and a half and it seems that some people with their first video, they get very lucky, the algorithm picks them up and I mean, their content is good, the personality is good and they, they do it, they, they grow and they make it really, really quick and that's awesome. 
but for some of us my personality has been changing because from the very beginning if you go to my first videos just me talking to the camera is so freaking weird and I can say I'm way more comfortable than I was before and my editing and everything has gotten much better from where I was a year and a half ago so for everyone out there that's thinking of going into YouTube and saying and believing that they're gonna be making a lot of money right off the bat that is not the case guys definitely not the case it is a lot of hours a lot of time put into this I, t I woke up today at 6 a.m. to come and film this video so I can have some content to upload for next week or this week I work a full-time job I have a family I have bills to pay and this is really hard to fit into my schedule so for all of you guys out there it does seem like this is possible you know I'm not there yet definitely not there yet but it seems that if I continue this weekly video upload I could potentially reach a much bigger revenue off of this channel and like I mentioned in every video I'm trying to go full-time so this will definitely help me out and get there much faster I guess if you guys found this helpful don't forget to give a like on this video I really really appreciate it guys thank you so much we're getting so close to 600 subs Still a long road ahead of us, but we're gonna get there. So definitely, if you guys are thinking of opening a YouTube channel, do it because you want to either learn, get better on your editing skills, your filming skills, or just want a reason to go out and create, that's definitely why you should do this. All right guys, I'll see you on the next video.